Tuesday, September 4th, 5.30 p.m. Back at the ranch. I'm tightening up the greenhouse. And I'll bring you guys along. Show you around. I'm doing some fall cleaning. Nice end dive, and I got lettuces coming up for win for a nice winter crop. It's a big lemon thyme that's taken over, a mosquito plant. We got a blueberry that made it. Purple Urkel. This is an aronia berry, so we'll see how this does. Looks like I got a strawberry in there. Some basil. Really nice looking kale. This shard's been grown since spring. So a little stunted soil here. I've been trying to rework it. Got some real nice carrots in the back here. Look at the arugula, it's just huge. I'm gonna make a salad tonight. Mm. Nice chilies, Mr. Stripies. Mm. Some nice chilies, nice tomatoes. Gonna have a really nice salad. <laughs> Come to think of it, Look at this variegated basil, hibasso. Take a look at those beets. Can you beat it? You can't beat that. How about this? This looks like a carrot. Look at that. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. We are gonna make a salad. And that is a cosmic purple. Holy macaroni. That's insane. Remember it. But that's a little fatty. <laughs> Rizzle. Okay, let's get on with the uh, tour. What else can we find in these layers? We have layers upon layers of tomatoes, and you just come and. Mmm. Look at these chilies in here. Drying on the stem. We better take these in. Deep maroon. Those are banging. So I've been cleaning up these ladies and mulching down low. Some nice peppers in here. Maybe that'll go in the salad. That looks like it should. Some gorgeous poblano on the stem. Ooh, eggplant. Some more interesting eggplants down here. These are like a white eggplant. Really nice chilies. I'll show you that one. It's just food everywhere. Come and get it. Some massive kales. Look at the size of these leaves. Or collards. Another beet factory underneath. You always plant in layers. <laughs> Some more chilies. Tomatoes. My favorite is this black tomato, this Bradley. Extremely prolific. I've been I got about a hundred tomatoes out of this. Mmm. And so that is a uh, really an amazing uh, first year with good yields. Really getting to know the greenhouse. I'm really pleased. You can see some uh, lettuces here going to seed. So what we do here is we 
take these outside and we'll seed somewhere. But for the fall here, I got a little lettuce bed here. I'll just show you what the seeds look like here. They're tiny. And so I'll just seed this. And then you'll see what it looks like in just a week or so. I did this in other areas, and you can see all the lettuces coming up on that bird's nest uh, tomato there. Pretty amazing. So we'll just put some of these lettuces in here so we can have killer fall salads. And you guys uh, will follow us on the salad tour here <laughs> as it pops up. We'll just throw them in there. And then so I just usually just run my hands over it because lettuces only need a little bit. It's so moist in here. They'll just come up on their own. You really don't have to do anything in a greenhouse if you have the proper moisture. This is a two-year-old pink afghan. Looking pretty nice. Thanks for coming.